Hello everyone, welcome to another video, book recommendation video. I don't know what to call these things, but I think book recommendation, because I'm recommending a book. So that's literally what it is. Today's book is The Sentinel. This by Jeffrey Convitz. I have to admit, I have, I, have, I read this recently, so I haven't read it. And I saw the movie recently. I'll talk about that too, but the book is really good. Really good. I, I didn't... I, I saw the movie first again. I think I, talk, I said that before with uh, The Devil of the Daughter. I saw the movie first. I'm a big Hammer movie fan. and I, you know, So I watched the movie, then read the book. But the book's really good. But I wish I would have read the book first. Same thing with this. I saw the movie. Like, uh, I got this in there. This was a bookstore. Look at it. There's a great... Look at that. Look at that cover. Look at that. It's creepy. Look creepy book. Wait, wait for it. Look at that. Let's see if I can get a little closer. I'm not very good at this. Oh, you can see my ball. That's creepy. I'm in the cover now. But yeah, isn't that cool? But uh, yeah, we'll get into it. But anyway, the book's really good. Way better than the movie. I highly recommend this book. So, The Sentinel by Jeffrey Convitz. A novel that takes you to the very boundaries of belief and one shattering step beyond. The Sentinel. A beautiful young model. The old brownstone apartment she simply had to have. The grotesque, blind priest who watched down on her day and night from the upper story window. I have to admit, uh, Carradine, Car John Carradine in the movie, he was creepy. You know, but they didn't, you know, they didn't show him much. But anyway, he was pretty creepy in the movie. But when you're reading it, you're, you know. Anyway, that's not the point. The pair of perverted creatures who wanted her to join their circle. The mad little old man who gave her tea and sympathy. The cool, calculating, supremely rational lover who first mocked her fears. And the secret you will never be able to forget, even, even if you try. The Sentinel by Jeffrey Compens. Um, Here it is. That's all I was going to show. Let's show the cover again. That's cool. But look, it says, Rosemary's Baby. The Exorcist, the other, now the ultimate intrusion of evil. Now the pro now let's go to the movies real quick. You know this is a book recommendation, so that's already done. Get this, highly recommend. I love this book. I'm gonna read this again, actually. You know, give it some time to forget about it and reread it. But anyway, in, in book form, this is this is true. This statement, movie form, it is not. Rosemary's Baby. Uh, excellent book. I forgot who wrote it. It's uh, horrible, but I read it. The book, but the movie's really good. It was by uh, Roman Polanski. Really good movie. Then you got The Exorcist by uh, Blatty. Uh, and the movie was done by William Friedkin. Movie's excellent. Then you have The Other, which was by, oh my gosh, my brain. As I get older, my brain doesn't work as well. Uh, Robert Mulligan. Uh, he, uh, he did uh, To Kill a Mockingbird, so he knows how to make a movie. He did a great job on the other. Great movie, if you haven't seen that. Great. That's a good book, too, by the way. Uh, but unfortunately for Jeffrey Convents, he got... Again, I hate putting things down. I'm not a person to put things down, but he got Michael Werner. Or is it Winner? Winner? The, the guy who directed Death Wish. Um, and he's good at that. He's good at action. He just did not capture the horror of this novel at all i don't it's comical it, when you're reading this it's not comical it's creepy and ah it's so good and the movie it just comes across as uh there's some creepy elements sure and he has such great actors in it oh my gosh in that movie and it just again i don't like to put things down someone out there is probably thinking that's my favorite movie and that's fine that's fine it's just to me they missed they missed it they missed the they needed a different director anybody but him to direct it. But anyway, that's not the point. This is a book recommendation. So forget about the movie. Go straight to the book. And you'll be very, very happy. I promise. I love this book. So that's today's book recommendation. The Sentinel. Jeffrey Collins. With the creepy cover. Look at that. Oh, man. Look at that. Let me do it again. Well, you just come out. We'll find out. Let's do that real quick. There. Whoops. There we go. Um, you got places to be. 1974. The year I was born again. Huh. Anyway, till next time, everybody. Have a great day. 